This morning's coffee with is with Mesa. Ladies and gentlemen, let's welcome Mesa back to WJZ. Good morning. How are you doing? So we're sitting here. Sweetie, how you doing, baby? And you just said, here we go again. I know. It's time. Again. Again. Every time is special when you walk in. Oh, thank you, honey. How many years have you been coming in here? Did we figure? 22 years I've been coming here. Yeah. Yeah. Wow. I posted the footage of um, me, you, and Don. Uh, I think the first time I was here. Did you? Mm -hmm. Like I a had throwback Thursday? Uh huh, yeah. So, so I should do that this week, too. That is, yeah, you ought to. <laughs> yeah, I think follow Mesa, that. by the way, on mm -hmm. Facebook. Mm -hmm. What's your Twitter handle? At Mesa Leak. Okay. Mm -hmm. L E E K E? Yeah, L E. No, just the L E A K. All right. Mm -hmm. I just wanted to make sure. You know, cause, <laughs> and Sal, if I ever spelled your last name, it's just always Mesa. Yeah, I'm one name. <laughs> so yeah. you've got a new album dropping. Yeah. Love is a Battlefield. You we just said. They didn't like that cover on I know. It's beautiful, though. It is, too. I know. What was it's the different. problem? Uh, I think they just wanted the kind of glamour shots, typical, you know, Stephen White's cover. I was like, I don't want to do that this year, because this, I chose Love is a Battlefield. I mean, it was a huge hit, and um, Pat Benatar on a rock song and all that kind of stuff, and the way I flipped the song, kind of as a ballad, um, and, and the meaning behind, the reason why I chose this song is because just of the title, Love is a Battlefield. It means, and to me, it's like we're in a place in our, in our world where people are still, I think love is fighting to gain prominence again, it seems like, uh, in, in people's decisions and compassion for each other. And, uh, and that's, why, that's, what I'm really, that's why I really chose that title. And I just think the cover fits the mood. Reflects that. I think it's it cool yeah. you still have creative control over, your, over the cover. I do. The artwork. I always yeah, it's because you made it. <laughs> <laughs> it, comes with, <laughs> it comes with that resume. <laughs> Incognito <laughs> Grammy nomination. It was interesting because it was interesting. Because I saw a post you put up on, I guess it was Facebook, maybe last week, mm -hmm. hoping for a Grammy nod this year. Mm -hmm. You really feel this is... I think so. You think so? I do. I feel it. I really feel it. I mean, there's several songs on the album that I think, is, but I think the title track, should be nominated. I really do. And uh, my production team, the Heavyweights um, from LA, uh, featuring uh, the guy uh, Jamie Jones from Group All for One, they produced this track. And you know, they were scared of it at first. We all, my record company was like, "Love is a battlefield. Why would you want to do that song?" <laughs> and I'm like, "I love this song, and the lyrics mean something to me, and melody is beautiful. And so I just want to slow it down, make it kind of Sade-ish, kind of nice vibe." And so. They were like, okay, let's, we can try that. But they were really, they, they tried to talk me into some other song. You know what this tells me? Mm -hmm. That the music industry right now, that, that life is very tight in the big town. Mm -hmm. that, mm -hmm. that people think the ice is very thin yeah. and don't want a chance walking out on it. Right. Is that the music that's culture it. in that's 2017? It. Absolutely. I mean, that's what's going on right now in the culture. Because, I mean, everybody wants to play it safe because, you know, it's, because, it, Really, we really cannot make money making records anymore. Yeah. The, the way you make money now is going on tour. That's the big thing now. And that's how you start being back in the 70s and 80s, what, 70s, 60s, 70s. People made records so they could go on tour to have something to, to promote. And now it's becoming, you know, then in the 70s, 80s, 90s, it became, well, you know, just be a superstar and you can sell a bunch of records and you can go on tour if you want to. You know, a lot of people didn't have to tour. They made so much money from the sales of the album. But now it's now we've come back. back to yeah, but now this technology has turned the it tour. around. Yeah, this is a promotion. Real quick, and then we are going to do a web actually. We are going to take this online because mm -hmm. I, I sense you're in a very honest mood this morning. <laughs> no, I mean that mm -hmm. because you know you look. You have the chops. You have the resume. I mean, you're a local <laughs> girl. I've run into you at Target, whatnot. But, <laughs> but nonetheless, you are a legitimate star. Love is a battlefield. All right, Mason. Thank you, honey. Ain't tough. We're going to take a break. Come right back. It's WJZ.